guys welcome to the channel welcome back to the channel for those of you that subscribed if you haven't please do so it really helps it out make us uh, grow the community a little bit if you read down uh, below the comments have been all great don't get too much riffraff in uh, in the community so really appreciate that this week we're doing born under bad sign by cream another uh, rhythm song full rhythm another blues song uh, level six this one and real quick about the levels right i just passed the level eight entrance exam right so i'm kind of a level eight uh rhythm player level seven on lead and if you were to ask me what does that mean i would say well that means you know any song that comes up you know level eight you could play it level seven just as it's you know you've never seen it before it comes up and you're just playing it and level six songs there you crush them without even a second thought but in my experience it hasn't been like that the way it's working is i can learn those level seven and level eight songs although i haven't really dabbled in level eight too much yet um, but it's still taking me like this level six song is almost a week you know to try to learn it and it's just a level six right where you think is a level eight player could just it scrolls and you just play not like that for me you know maybe some of the other guys can do that but for me it still takes me a week to learn it it just means that it's a little bit easier to learn right then as opposed to i go and try to learn a level nine song right that'll be real difficult level six i know i could learn and the levels are helpful in that way in telling you what you can and and shouldn't play but as far as you know equating to just being able to jump in and just nail it, it it doesn't work like that it still takes a ton of practice to be able to even remotely play those things and that's what we're going to do we're going to just remotely play born under a bad sign let's go
almost perfect. Next time, you'll nail it. Can we talk about playing timid for a minute here? Man, it's the worst feeling when you're playing and you're like, uh oh, here comes another note. Am I gonna nail that one? Uh oh, here comes a chord change. Oh, thank God I got that one. Can I now do the next section? Oh, messed that up a little bit. Man, that sucks. Am I gonna get the next one? Am I gonna miss it? It's just that timid feeling, right? Where you're not getting after it, you're not grooving, you're not in time, you're not having fun. You're like, uh, can I do it? Can I do it? It's just, it's a weird, weird feeling uh, to play like that. Maybe those of you guys that are more experienced can comment down below and let us know whether that feeling ever goes away. Is it just an attitude problem? Is it, uh, you know, when, when you play more complex pieces, do you still feel that way? Or does that go away? I think I think the obvious solution, right, is more practice and being good, and that way you're not timid because you know you could crush these pieces. Um, so I'm, I'm sure that's a big part of it. And obviously I'm nowhere near that, so that's how I'm playing, just playing timid, deer in the headlights, right? You see me staring at musician trying to make sure I don't miss anything. Uh, it's a bummer. But uh, all right, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.